this is Ricky, and this is Forza Motorsport Career Mode Update 11. Let's go. Let's go. 350R, 2016. I was using it the other day, and just today, one of my friends, Fractured, brought it to my attention that it's really good in S class. And we were playing around with it in A class. So I'm going to build it, take it over to the Career Mode S class open trial, and see how it does. So this is how I'm going to build the car for you guys for S class. Check it out for us. So, first off, you know I love grip. So we're going to look at the tires, and we already have race tires on here, so that's great. But let's increase the width on everything to the max width. That only brings us to 704, which is great. But um, since we do want it to handle, and let's put a wing on it then. Let's see. I'm building for handling. So look at this one right here. We get a 5.0 handling and a 4.5 acceleration. That's great. And a 5.145 by putting full arrow on it. Let's do it. Um, I'm not worried about that. Let's look at the body kit, though. Ooh, the body kit, we do get a little more, and it actually takes away a point. It should slow us down a bit, but it's going to make this thing look mean. And I'm not worried about top speed. So we're taking the body kit. That's awesome. I'm not going to do an engine swap or aspiration conversion or drive change swap. None of that. Um, we do have a body kit with full arrow. Well, now I can just do rear because of the body kit. We got the race transmission. Let's do full. No, let's come back to this section, the drivetrain. And we'll skip over here to the. We already know we got the fattest tires on here. Oh, no, look. Our tires were reset when we changed the body kit. So we got race tires. But the we can get fatter tires now because we got a wide body. So now we can go 355s in the fronts and 365s in the rear. And let's go ahead and see if we can get a weight reduction on here. Yes, we can. So full weight reduction. Let's put a cage. It actually doesn't do much. The cage there, let's see. Just drops down. I don't even see any handling come, and we lose a point. Um, what's it do to acceleration? A little slower. On everything. And I'm not even really seeing a... It does make it break better. All right, we'll do a full cage in it. If we come down to a points difference, we know what we're taking out. Full brakes. Look, I did all the handling stuff here. Um, now let's put minimal power to it. It doesn't need much. I'm sure it's quick. <clears throat> I will bump displacement and exhaust. And let's see what else. If there's somewhere better to put these 13 points than power. Nothing in there, nothing in there. We can change the rims. I'm sure those are good rims, though. Let's come back here to the drivetrain and throw the clutch. Race differential. Race driveline. And that'll be everything except for six more points of performance, wherever we can put that. Let's look at ignition. Uh, we can do a little better than that. Intake manifold. There we go. That's actually, it. let me see, compared to air filter. Yeah, it's better. Let's look over here on valves. Mm, pistons. No, we can't do camshaft. All right, so we will be putting the intake manifold and throttle body. And that's pretty much our build right there. I think that's it. If you notice, I have 14 hours to complete these, you guys. And there's seven more races to do to get that Lamborghini Reventon. Or I forget how to pronounce it, whatever. I'm tired. But I'm going to go do these. So where's the car that I just made? My cars. Here it is. I don't even want to look at the stats. I'm just going to go try it. And we're taking this at Hakuna. At Hakone. Hakone. This beautiful fictional racetrack in Japan. Skip and practice. We're going for it. That's what I meant by right in. I will run medium tire tread. And I'll do eight laps of fuel. Let's go.
and it's a night race. And me. So let's see if I can get this Viper in the Shelby. I do have arrow on this baby. Almost max. Oh, she rips. Kick her to 8,000. Yeah. She handles too. Oh, yes. This car's great with this arrow. I might be able to eat this Viper up, actually. Let's see. Maybe not. It's fast. It is ACR. Six laps here, you guys. Hardest difficulty, no driving aids or assist. This is Forza Motorsport Career Mode, update 11. I think it looks great. It feels great too. This car's this car's awesome. I just gotta try to stay consistent. And work on this Viper little by little. Not try to do too much at once. Yeah, let's go. One lap down, and I'm only a second behind Go Crazy Toes in this Viper, at least it's this ghost, it's AI. Oh, and that's a great racer in a great car, so I lost a little bit right there. That V10, let's go. I don't like my lines right now. Oh. It's so live though. Okay, that's two laps. Still alive, I'm in second. Third's coming quick though. on the top speed. We've been catching right here. Last two laps. It's good. Good to know. On these last laps, we'll use that. We'll need it probably. Oh no, wrong gear. Alright, three laps down, three to go. This is the halfway point. And I'm less than a second behind him, so we're okay. Gotta stay, stay smooth, stay consistent.
So right here, I'm suing it. I haven't gone anywhere. I'm a second behind and I have two laps left. Right catch right here, come on. I'm right here, about to go into the final lap. Oh, don't penalize me, please. No, I'm safe. Final lap, let's go. We're neck and neck. Final lap, it's do or die. Barely won that one, you guys. That was a little too close for comfort, if you ask me. But that was a great car and a great opponent, so. Sheesh. Let's go. Next, 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 next. Support your boy. Thanks for riding with me. Make sure to check out the thousands of videos on my channel. Let's go.